Hi everybody, thank you for watching. So here is my Rite Aid haul for this week. So I actually have two transactions here. So we have that amazing spend 60, get $20 back in bonus cash in the ad. There's actually four unique coupons just like um, every other week. So I got one from the ad, there's one from the website, one from an email and then also one from Facebook. So I was able to use two of them um, in these two transactions and then I, I can still go back and do the deal two more times. So I am still contemplating whether I want to go back, but I did pick up all of these. It worked out to be a huge money maker. So I will go over the breakdown of each of the deals, show you my receipt and let you know how much I paid in the end. Um, there are some amazing deals. I also have some bonus cash challenges here that I ended up getting so i will go over those as well so the first deal that i did i uh, picked up the poise the one by poise so they're on a clearance for 50 percent off so they are four dollars and 74 cents each so i did pick up two of them so that came to nine dollars and 48 cents i had two three dollar coupons that we got in this week's insert so i paid 3.48 i bought is giving back three dollars on each of them so i did get six dollars back from my barter and then with fetch i had a rebate to get four thousand points which is equivalent of four dollars back when you purchase two of them so i did get that one as well so it worked out to be a six dollar and 52 cent money maker just for those alone um i did notice at the end of my receipt that that uh those items are actually tracking with the you buy Kotex deal which is spend 15 get five dollars back if i knew that i would have probably picked up more of them but at the same time i actually have a bonus cash challenge for you by Kotex so i really wanted to do that deal and then like these liners and stuff are items that we actually use so i ended up doing that on a separate uh on a separate transaction when i did go to the store to purchase these items they were completely out by the you by kotex so i did pick up the poise almost as a filler and it worked out to be a huge money maker and tracking towards the deal anyway so i did pick that one up so if you do see these in your store um do pick them up um these items here i actually did uh on sunday and so i did it at a different store so a store that i don't usually go to and then i did go to my store yesterday and picked up these but anyway, I did pick up the poise. So amazing deal there if you can see those in the store because they are they are four seventy four. We uh, you got the three dollar coupon, three dollars back from my barter, and then also the fetch reward deal. So amazing deal there. The next deal I did is a Neutrogena. So the Neutrogena is a buy two get a six dollar bonus cash. With this one. Um, in the store, so this is the store that I don't usually go to, it was tagged cheaper and so I factored that in and got like an expensive Vaseline and Starburst to get to the $60 mark. In the end, it actually scanned for more expensive. I didn't notice until I got home, but in the end, it worked out to be a good deal. So with the Neutrogena, it is buy two, get a $6 bonus cash, and the limit is two. So I picked up two of these wipes. These were $7.69 each, and then two of the oil-free makeup removal. They are $7.49. In the store, they were $6.99 and $6.79. So big uh, price job with inflation and they just did not change the tags. So I did pick up these. So that worked out to be a cost of $30.36. I had four of those printable coupons. So I do use my Swagbox link to print these coupons. And so I will, I should get 50 cents back on each of those coupons when um probably in about six weeks. Usually after you've redeemed the coupon, it takes about four to six weeks for it to hit your account. So I will get a bonus $2 basically for these four. So I paid $18.36, I got the $12 back, worked out to be a cost of $6.36 or $1.59 each, which is quite high, but I do have a bonus cash challenge for Neutrogena. It does say that it excludes makeup, but these items do track for it. So I actually got that bonus cash last uh last week when i did the deal and so i wouldn't it wouldn't qualify me for this one but i do have that bonus cash challenge so if you have that this will be a huge money maker for you so i did do that 
The next deal that I did is the Sally Hansen. So it is buy two, get a $4 bonus cash. You could do that deal twice. So the cheapest items that I found were these hard as nail nail polish. So they are $3.99 each. So four of them did come to $15.96. I got the $8 back. We're going to be cost of $7.96 or $1.99 each. No coupons. I'm not sure if we do have coupons, but yeah, I just picked up those. Then I did the Vaseline deal. So when I did go to this store, it was early on Sunday, I think, and they did not have the tags up. So I wasn't sure which Vaseline was part of the deal. I just know that these were in the in the ad. So I did pick up these ones, which were more expensive. Um, I ended up picking up the cheaper ones that still work for the deal and would have been a bigger money maker. But I ended up picking up these. So the Vaseline is a buy two, get a $4 bonus cash. The, they are also buy one get one fifty percent off. So I picked up one of them at four fifty nine. The second one up at two twenty nine. So the two of them came to six dollars and eighty eight cents. I got the four dollars back. If you watch my other video, I have a Vaseline bonus cash challenge, and I was just short of under a dollar. So these did qualify. So I will get the three dollars back. Work out to be a twelve cent money maker for those ones there. So because of the Neutrogena not being tagged right, to get to the $60 mark, I threw in this Starburst, which was $0.99, cents, and there was a $0.50 cent peeling on it just to get to the $60 mark. So I will show you my receipt. So over here, you've got the one by Poise. Uh, there's the $3 coupons there. There's all the Neutrogena with the $3 coupons. There are all the Sally Hansen. There's the Starburst for $0.99. Cents. There's a two Vaseline. She ended up charging me for a bag. And then there is a 50 cent Peely for the Starburst. So for this transaction here, before coupons, the total was $63.67. I paid 10 cents for a bag. So it came to 63.77. And then I had $18.50 worth of coupons. So I paid 45.27, including tax, I paid 49.63 and then i got back 44 in bonus cash as well as three dollars back in bonus cash challenge for the vaseline six dollars back for poise and then four dollars and ten cents back for the poise for the fetch so i paid 49.63 including tax after all of the bonus cash and the ibotta and the fetch this worked out to be a seven dollar and 47 cent money maker for all those items so amazing deal there so i did all of those on one transaction in one store and then um, the next day i ended up going to another store and did all of these so for the first deal on these i did pick up the cover girl so this is the cover girl face excludes the eye and the lip so to spend 15 get a five dollar bonus cash and you can do that deal twice so i was planning to do it twice so i did pick up these items here so i did pick up the blush they are 7.49 each and then i did pick up the powder that is 8.49 so for the four of those it did come to 30 dollars and 96 cents so i did have to pick up the more expensive powder to get over the 30 dollar mark I had four three dollar manufactured coupons that I got in a recent insert. So I paid eighteen ninety six. I got the ten dollars back. Work out to be a cost of eight dollars and ninety six cents for those ones there. The next thing I did is the U by Kotex. So the U by Kotex is spend fifteen get a five dollar bonus cash, and you could do that deal twice. Because I picked up some of the one by Poise, I had about $9 tracking in bonus cash. So I really had to only spend about $20 or $21 to get to the $30 mark to get two $5 bonus cash back. So what I did was I picked up two of the liners. They are $8.99, buy one get one 50% off. So the second one rang up at $4.49. And then the pads, they are $5.79 and the second one rang up at $2.89. So for the four of them, it did come to $22.16. So like I said, I was trying to hit the $30 mark and I did have with the poise um, um, on my receipt, um, it says here that I had $9.48 tracking for the poise. So I wanted to, I just needed about $21 to get to that. So I did pick up those. So it came to $22.16. I used 
four of the two old manufacturer coupons that we got in a recent insert. So I paid $14.16. I got $10 back in bonus cash. I had a bonus cash challenge. If I spend $17, I get $4.30 back. So I do get that. And then with Fetch, I had two separate um, Fetch rebates, a dollar off uh, two and then a dollar fifty off two and then just some extra points so i got two dollars and sixty seven back in fetch so for all of this work out to be a two dollar and eighty one cent money maker for those ones there so at this store they did not have the poise i was contemplating getting like cheaper uh co you buy codex and then fill using the poise as a filler they did not have them in stock uh, but either way it worked out to be a money maker the next deal I did, so this Vaseline, so it's the same promotion as that one. It is buy two, get a $4 bonus cash. These are buy one, get one 50% off. These are the smaller ones. They are cheaper. If you wanted to do this deal, you could probably pick up four of these and it worked out to be a huge money maker. So they are $1.99. So buy one, get one 50% off. The second one rang up at 99 cents. So for the two of them, it came to $2.98. You're getting $4 back. It worked out to be a $1.02 money maker. So no coupon. Bonds. just with bonus cash these work out to be a money maker so if you want a really good filler you can get these vaseline get four of them get two of them and then those are good filler to get to the 60 dollar mark the other item that i got just as a filler i picked up the chic so with all these items i was at like 56 dollars so i did pick up the chic and um, they are 5.99 disposables and we have four dollar manufacturer coupons in this week's insert so i paid 1.99 for that one there Everything on that transaction there, I will show you my receipt. So over here, you've got the cover girl. So there's all the four of them. There is the chic with a $4 manufactured coupon. There's all the you buy Kotex there, and there's a Vaseline. So for before coupons, all of those items would have cost $62.09. I had $24 in coupons, so I paid $38.09, including tax is $41.18. I got back $44, so already a huge money maker there. So I got back $44. I also got back $4.30 from the bonus cash challenge for my U by Kotex, and then and $2.67 back from Fetch for the U by Kotex. So for all those items, I paid $41.18. I got all those bonus cash, bonus cash challenge, and fetch back. We got to be a $9.79 money maker for that one there. So huge money maker. So all of these items. So I've I've basically done the Neutrogena twice, the Sally Hansen twice, I did the U by Kotex twice, and the CoverGirl and the Vaseline. So all these deals are limit of two, and I have maxed them out this week. And so I have done this spend 60, get 20 back twice. So I'm really happy with all the deals that I got at Rite Aid. So for all these items, everything that you see here on the table before coupons would have cost me $125.75. So I did do the spend 60, get 20 twice. After all coupons, rebates, uh, bonus cash, bonus cash challenges, all of these work out to be a $17.47 money maker. So amazing. Um, I did have to spend um, some out of pocket. So with the first transaction, I did not have enough bonus cash. So I had to spend $10.81 out of pocket, but I did get back. I used my PayPal debit card. So basically with the money that i get from i bought it i put it into my paypal and then i roll that money so with the poise um with the i bought a deal so i got six dollars and then i rolled that into my paypal and then i used my paypal debit card so i kind of had to spend a little bit out of pocket with that one because i was short on bonus cash but now i have a lot so i on the last transaction i earned 44 and i still had about four dollars in bonus cash um in my balance and then at the same time with the rewards points so this is a really good deal we always forget to talk about this but the rewards points for every 1000 points that you uh with every 1000 points that you earn that's about two dollars so i got an extra two dollars there that i can convert to bonus cash which is uh this is the new promotion instead of the tier bronze silver and gold now they're giving you points that you can redeem to bonus cash so that's about it. That's everything I got at Rite Aid. Um, so I, I'm contemplating whether I'll do another deal, but hopefully I can do the deal at least once or twice and then 
post another video. I will have no videos up next week. We are going away for my birthday. So we are leaving like Friday and we don't come back till Saturday. So I'm gone for literally the whole week. Um, I don't know if I'll do any couponing at all on the road. Um, I We're going to Lake Tahoe, we go to Monterey Bay, we're going to Fresno, we're doing all of Northern California. Um, so we'll see. Um, of course, we're going to have to do some grocery shopping while we're out and about, but I'm not sure if I'll be doing any couponing. But um, other than that, this is everything I got at Rite Aid, and then I am working on my CVS. I went to CVS and well, I went to my CVS store the other day, and they were completely wiped out of a lot of stuff. So I do have to go to a different store and see if I could do some of the deals. And hopefully, I'll have a video up for you tomorrow for CVS. So yeah, here is my Rite Aid haul. Thank you for joining me. <laughs> Gah, 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 gah,